Yo, 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 what's up, y'all? My name is Ray Nail Roy. Welcome to my channel, Fish and Trips. We back for another vlog, y'all. All right, man, check it. I got a good vlog for y'all today, man. Guess what? See that? See that right there? That's called fresh water. Yeah, guess what I'm doing today? Yeah, guess what I'm doing today? That's right. I'm going after a fish. I've been chasing for 365 days unsuccessfully. I'm going for a fish that I've spent about $500 worth in gear and equipment and still have not catched unsuccessfully. I'm going for a fish that I have titled and declared to be racist. That's right. The elusive urban rainbow trout. Y'all, look man, let me tell you something. I went searching for these rainbow trout maybe like five, six times last year. Skunked every time. Every time. This particular park, I said I was never going to come back to because of some thugs. Thugs terrorized this park by the name of Kuma Rats. That's right. Kuma Rat birds eating everything in sight in that water. And they're there. They're here again today. They stocked the rainbow trout, they said, about two hours ago. No one has caught anything because I'm convinced all the Kuma Rat birds have already ate them. So whatever, man. I'm out here to catch my first rainbow trout. For the next 90 days, the Texas Park and Wildlife will be stocking rainbow trout out and around Houston for the next 90 days, okay? I'm going to catch $500 worth of rainbow trout to get my damn money back, okay? There's a limit of five per day. I figure each rainbow trout is about $10. I need to catch 50 rainbow trout over the next 90 days to make up for all the money I lost over the last year trying to catch this damn fish. Not only if I do catch this fish, guess what, man? I'm so hyped about catching this fish, I ain't throwing nothing back. Every rainbow trout I catch is getting eight. Eight, okay? Y'all think I'm playing? Bro, I got my stove, my propane, my skillet, and my butter in the truck. I just gotta catch the fish. I think I can do it. So hungry. So hungry. <gasps> oh. Enjoy the vlog, y'all. There you go. It's cold outside, but the fire keeps us warm. We can't spend the night beneath the mistletoe. It's cold outside, 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 outside. It's cold outside, outside, outside. Here we go. All right, y'all, so apparently about 11 a.m. this morning, the rainbow trout were stocked right here, adjacent to the pier. So my thought process is, if you just got taken away from your home that you've been chilling at for about six months growing, um, in the middle of the night you got picked up and dropped off at some random location, I'm gonna stay near the structure. All right, so I'm gonna get my um, old 18 buzz. I'm gonna use my actual um, kayak fishing setup. I got my Shimano Vanford 500. My five pound braid, 10 pound leader with a buzz on there. I got some backup that I'm gonna try just in case if the buzz don't work, but who knows? Maybe the buzz can catch a rainbow trout. <sighs> Let's start. I ain't gonna say I'm feeling optimistic, but you know what I'm saying? I think I can do it. Come on, let's go. And here comes the rain. Oh my God. All right, we're getting rained out. Let's go, people. All right, of course, as soon as I start fishing, it's raining. It's raining. It's all good, though. The rain is not going to deter me. The coma rats are not going to deter me. I'm about to get a rainbow trout. Nice meeting you. Say your name again? Jose. Jose. I'm gonna remember that. Jose. We'll see if you make the vlog, Jose. I'm good, man. Appreciate it. I'm gonna get you barefoot in the water. 
Whoa, 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 whoa. Almost caught a damn bird. Oh my God. That was close. Got to do a catch clean and cook buzzard. All right, update, man. I've been out here for about two hours, y'all. In two hours, I have not seen not one person catch one fish, okay? I've spoken to people who've been out here since 8 a.m. this morning, zero fish. The thugs, man. The Kumarat thugs. They've eaten all the fish. I gotta stop doing this to myself, man. I gotta give up my dream of catching a rainbow trout. I had my expectations set too high, you know what I'm saying? I'd be damned if a comrade just caught a rainbow trout right there in front of me. You disrespectful. No, I'm not playing. Look at this. Look at this. You see that? See that little thug? That's a thug right there. Just caught a rainbow trout. Just caught a rainbow trout. <clears throat> I need somebody to leave in the comments below what is the fine for killing comrades. What's the fine? You know what I'm saying? What's the fine for killing kumarats? And what do they taste like? I got a whole stove, frying pan and butter in my truck. I'm going to eat a kumarat. I'm going to eat a kumarat. All right, switching it up, man. I'm putting my old 18 up. I'm getting my ugly sick Shakespeare 36 inch ultralight rod. I bought this last year for these damn trout. Um, I have like six pound, I think it's mono. And um, I'm gonna try this little tiny, they call it a mice tail um, power bait with a small berry hook. Um, I think the way it works with a split shot, right? In addition to your split shot, you just kind of work it off the bottom. And I believe this power bait floats. So this shot on the ground, this floats up and it's kind of twerking it. I've seen people catch trout with this. This is my secret weapon, my go-to. It's about to rain, we gotta get this done. I gotta get one, man. I gotta get one to cook at this damn park to complete the catch, clean, and cook. One damn trout, Lord. I spent $500 in equipment. Can I get one? Just one, Lord. Just one. Let go. Shoot them down. Trout are deep. Running from the coolerets. I'm hungry, man. I'm hungry. If I don't catch a rainbow trout, I'm gonna have to resort to eating my stick of butter. I have no other option. I have no other option at this point. Grrrr. 